NASA's James Webb Space Telescope has made a surprising discovery that has astronomers all over the world in awe. The telescope discovered the universe's earliest known galaxy a few weeks ago, but now it has found something even bigger, a supermassive black hole that is leaving its galaxy at an incredible 4 million miles per hour. Scientists and space enthusiasts have speculated a lot about the significance of this most recent discovery and what it means for our comprehension of the universe. The James Webb Space Telescope was launched with the intention of exploring the very first stars and galaxies in the universe. Since its launch, the telescope has captured stunning images of the death of stars and galaxies a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. We invite you to explore the most recent results from this telescope with us. For more content similar to this one, remember to like and subscribe. The scientific community's current understanding is being challenged by the most recent discovery. Black Holes EO0059 Most people think of black holes as huge objects that pull everything, including light, toward them. However, the black hole that was recently observed appears to be acting in the opposite direction. It is creating new young stars along a long trail rather than absorbing light. This brand new trail of newly formed stars has been observed following the black hole, which is located some 200,000 light years away. The peculiar behavior of this black hole, in comparison to other black holes, baffles researchers. However, a group led by geoastronomy professor Banda published their findings recently in the Astrophysical Journal Letters. These observations were also confirmed by NASA's Hubble Space Telescope, which suggests that the black hole cools gas and brings forth new stars. Behind the black hole, we can see the wake. However, that's not all. The James Webb Space Telescope's capture of the galactic merger ARP-220 has resulted in an exciting announcement from NASA. It is clear that this impressive galaxy merger is shining among other galaxies in the night sky. All ain't 214. The phenomenon known as ARP220, which occurs when two spiral galaxies merge, shines brightest in the infrared, making it ideal for the James Webb Space Telescope's observation. With a luminosity of a trillion suns, it is categorized as an ultraluminous infrared galaxy, in contrast to our own galaxy, the Milky Way which has a luminosity of about 10 billion suns. About 250 million light-years away in the Serpent's constellation is ARP-220. It is thought to be the most brilliant of the three. In the Atlas of Peculiar Galaxies, it is listed as object number 2 on 20 because it is the closest galactic collision to Earth. Two spiral galaxies collided about 700 million years ago, causing a huge explosion of star formation. This resulted in the formation of a dense region with around 200 large star clusters and a diameter of about 5,000 light years. Surprisingly, this small region has the same amount of gas as the Milky Way. About 100 supernova remnants with a diameter of less than 500 light years were found in previous radio telescope observations. 3. 13. The Hubble Space Telescope showed that the parent galaxies are 1 through 200 light years apart, and that there is a rotating ring of star formation in each core that shines in the infrared. The James Webb Space Telescope's most recent images reveal an impressive galactic merger between the two galaxies. The gravitational pull that exists between the two galaxies can also be seen in the faint tidal tails that appear to be extending from the edge of the merger in this image. Last but not least, the orange, red, and ochre streams and filaments represent dispersed organic materials in ARP2 Pni Erushu. 344. When scientists discovered the primordial galaxies at the edge of the universe, it was yet another stunning discovery. That baffled them. They weren't sure that they were real. Because they hoped for the best, they shared the data with other scientists around the world concerned that they might be disguised galaxies in the vicinity. Amazingly, these ancient galaxies are real, according to the James Webb Space Telescope. We now have access to the most ancient galaxies ever observed thanks to this revolutionary telescope. 04, 
14. We now have a glimpse into the universe's distant past, thanks to the estimated 13.5 billion years it took for light from these galaxies to reach Earth. These galaxies were found when the universe was still young, which shows how quickly the first galaxies formed. The spectral data confirmed that some of these galaxies are even further away from us than Hubble could see. The discovery is significant because it confirms one of the James Webb Space Telescope's most crucial tasks. 0444. The James Webb Space Telescope, which will use light that has been traveling for more than 13.5 billion years to examine the A beginning of the universe, stands out because it can measure extreme redshifts, which lets astronomers look into the infrared and see the first galaxies in the universe. Because this discovery signifies a significant turning point in the investigation of the universe and the comprehension of its evolution. There is a palpable sense of excitement in the air. Our knowledge of the universe has greatly improved as a result of the discovery. 5. Sheen 14. This has prompted NASA to construct even more powerful telescopes than the James Webb Space Telescope in order to verify the accuracy of our understanding of the Big Bang. Four of the six primordial galaxies have extreme seis redshifts, indicating that Webb is observing them as if they existed 300 to 500 million years after the Big Bang, without heavy elements like carbon, according to data from Webb's F-spectrometer and near-infrared camera. Given that the universe is thought to be 13.8 billion years old, this is surprising. 05 or 43. The fact that these galaxies exist suggests that our understanding of the early universe needs to be revised. The current cosmological inflation model and the Big Bang theory, which have some flaws, like going against the law of thermodynamics and not having a clear explanation for what caused the Big Bang, are being challenged by these new discoveries, which have caused concern in the scientific community. Galaxies almost as old as the Big Bang are being discovered by the James Webb Space Telescope, which casts doubt on everything we thought we knew about the universe's birth. 6. 10. Michio Kaku, a theoretical physicist, claims that the James Webb Space Telescope's discovery of ancient galaxies has cast doubt on everything we knew about the universe's beginning. In the past, it was thought that these galaxies were less advanced than the Milky Way. However, the new findings suggest that we may be overlooking important data. The fact that six billion-year-old galaxies have been found by the telescope, years after the Big Bang, and are up to ten times larger than the Milky Way, raises the question of whether our current theories about the creation of the universe are correct. 6. 37. According to Kaku's explanation, the formation of a galaxy like the Milky Way takes billions of years. Therefore, the discovery of such massive young primordial galaxies is odd. The textbooks on the universe's beginning may need to be rewritten in light of this discovery. The James Webb Space Telescope's findings cast doubt on our preconceived notions regarding the Big Bang. 7. 06. Despite this, NASA recently shared a tweet about a galaxy cluster that formed just 650 million years after the Big Bang, putting yet another intriguing piece of the puzzle together. The data have been analyzed by astronomers, and they have come to the conclusion that this relatively new cluster is likely to expand in size and eventually resemble the enormous Coma Cluster A11656 because it is in a region of accelerating galactic evolution the location where all of this is taking place is unique and special. 0739. The James Webb Space Telescope has allowed researchers to confirm that these seven galaxies are bound together in a proto-cluster because they can measure their velocities. NASA researchers compared these distant galaxies to tiny drops of water in various rivers that will eventually join together to form a large, powerful river. To put this into perspective, it is evident that our previous understandings of the Big Bang are not correct. 808. On the other hand, additional data from the Webb Telescope 
may reveal evidence that may support or disprove the theory. The cause of the Big Bang, on the E-Ed. Other hand, is a different matter. Who knows? In any case, additional discoveries will have to wait for us, but the answer might be closer than we think. What are your thoughts regarding these discoveries? I'll see you in the next video. Please, share your thoughts in the comment section. I am so grateful that you watched.